To be your own financial advisor, you have to have at least a rudimentary understanding of our tax structure and how our progressive tax structure works. So what does a progressive tax structure mean? It means that as your income rises, the percentage of that income that gets taxed away also rises. Now, conversely, as your income falls, this is important for retirees, the percentage of that income that gets taxed away also falls. So I want to make sure everybody understands how a progressive tax system works. So I've come up with this simplified progressive tax structure. So in our simplified fictional, this is fiction, progressive tax structure, there are two tax brackets. Taxable income up to $50,000 is taxed at 10%. Taxable income above $50,000 is taxed at 50%. So if I earn $40,000, my tax bill is $4,000, my marginal tax rate is 10%, and my average tax rate is 10%. If I earn $49,000, my, my tax bill is $4,900, my marginal tax rate is 10%, and my average tax rate is 10%. What if I earn $60,000? I get a raise from $49,000 to $60,000. This is the part that usually confuses people. So if you understand this, you have a good rudimentary understanding of our tax system or of how our tax system works. So I get a raise to $60,000. I'm now in the 50% marginal tax bracket. Is my tax bill $30,000? No, it is not. The first 50,000 generates a tax bill of $5,000 and the next $10,000 of taxable income generates a tax bill of also $5,000. So my tax bill is $10,000. So if I earn $60,000, my tax bill is $10,000. My, my marginal tax rate is now 50%. If I get a raise, another raise, I get to keep half of that raise. My average tax rate on $60,000 of taxable income is 10,000 divided by 60,000 equals 17%. So, as my income rises in this fictional uh, progressive tax structure, my average tax rate is going to climb to, to close to 50%. It will never reach 50%, but it will get closer and closer and closer to 50%. If I earn $10 million a year, the first 50,000 is still taxed at 10%, and then the next 9,900,000 and 50,000 is taxed at 50%. So I'd be very close to a 50% average tax rate, but I would be below it. Uh, okay, 80,000, let's do another example. The first 50 is taxed at 10%, so there's $5,000 of tax. The next 30, getting me to $80,000 of taxable income, is taxed at 50%, so that's $15,000 of tax. So my tax bill would be $20,000, 5,000 plus 15 equals $20,000, divided by my taxable income of $80,000, that would be a 25% uh, average tax rate. So that is how a progressive tax structure works. So why did I show a fictional tax structure? Because of this. Here is our actual tax structure in Ontario. Uh, you know, good luck looking at this. It, it's not that hard once you understand it, but if you show somebody this, their eyes will glaze over really quickly. So what do we have here? We have taxable income. Here's all the tax brackets. There's 14 of them. Our first tax bracket is tax-free. Students, take note. The first $12,000 generates no tax. So if you earn, you know, if you work in the summer and you earn $10,000, you will pay no tax. The highest tax bracket is 53% on income over 220,000. So that is, uh, you know, that's quite punishing. So this column here is marginal tax rates. This is taxable income. These are all the tax brackets. The last tax bracket is 200 is above $220,000. And here's how our marginal tax rates climb. Our marginal tax rates 
increase with taxable income except for this funny tax bracket here. This is not an error. It goes from 15 to 25 down to 20 and then it just climbs from there. All income is taxed using this except dividends from Canadian corporations and capital gains. The government wants you to invest in Canadian companies and the government, uh, so they give you a break on uh, investments into Canadian companies and the government wants you to invest. That's why they give you a break on capital gains. So that is why I show the simplified tax system because the actual tax system looks intimidating when you look at it. It really isn't. So I hope that helps. If you understand this, you have a rudimentary understanding of our tax system. Uh, and you, you, know, you are well on your way to understanding our tax system. And that took five minutes. So thank you for watching.